Okay, so uh, we just did push and now we're doing array.unshift. Uh, so unshift is like push, but a, it's like append. I, I'm not sure why it's called unshift. There's probably some good like math reason for that. But same thing, uh, you just put the value that you get as the second argument into the array that you get as the first argument. So if we have an empty array and we give a value one, then we expect back an array with one inside. So uh, I know you like your generic constraints, so something tells me we'll start there. And I'll put the new value in the front and spread the array on the there other side. There you go, yep. <laughs> so pretty much the inverse of the other one, uh, array.push, and pretty straightforward. I didn't find any other examples of how to do this online either. I looked for, I looked for all of these as before we go over them, and uh, it seems like this is the only way to do it. So this is how people do it. Cool.